Hey, what's going on, guys? My name is Ray, and I'm bringing you a gameplay here on Slums of Kill Confirmed on Black Ops 2 for the Nintendo Wii U. Now, I hope you guys enjoy this gameplay. This actually happens to be my most likely best gameplay so far that I've completely recorded. A 40 and 15 gameplay using the uh, CMS. I don't know the first couple numbers. Anyways, a pump action shotgun, the first one that you unlock. Great shotgun. Actually, my first shotgun, or first weapon that I've got gold so far on PS3, uh, which I got like a, a week and a half ago. But besides that, I really am liking this uh, Pro Controller. This actually happens to be my second gameplay with the Pro Controller. Uh, this gameplay came shortly after playing the gun game with the Pro Controller. So this happens to be my second gameplay. Actually happens to be my first, uh, you know, more semi-competitive gameplay so I really like that that I actually did very well and then you'll notice in this gameplay that I lag an extremely large amount as, as you can see there I was just teleporting it up now unfortunately I'm still new to the controller so as you can also see I stupidly decided to just keep using the shotgun instead of switching my gun and, and knifing you know I, I, I couldn't figure it out I was fumbling with the buttons a lot I was trying to reload and knife and <laughs> I actually looked at the controller trying to figure out wait wh which buttons so I can switch my weapon and basically I failed there so I didn't get all my killstreaks there but I do end up getting them I think twice this game so that's something I'm very happy about as I mentioned before in my previous commentary uh, my Wii Remote sniping commentary that I was struggling with the game and I wasn't able to get all my killstreaks and I was feeling like shit I am not good at this game anymore so luckily with the Pro Controller, I actually did manage to do very well, and I gotta admit, the Pro Controller and the shotgun is just a match made in heaven. I mean, the shotguns in this game are amazing, and the fact that the Wii U, while it does have its lag issues at some points, especially in this game, because this was like probably the only game that was available on the playlist. So, um, you know, this is my first kill confirmed on Black Ops 2 for the Wii U, so it probably was a very... Mm, terrible match with people from all over the country maybe which would explain the lag but I gotta say the hit detection in this game is freaking amazing I shoot people and you know guess what they actually died which is fantastic there was a guy with bad audio mic there that's something that pisses me off too kind of because you know people have pretty terrible mic sounding quality and then they just blabber on and then I have to pause the whole game and try to mute them uh, and again, fumbling with the whole control, trying to find out, hey, okay, how do I meet you? But hey, I do gotta say that I really do like the build quality of the Pro Controller. It really, it just, it looks amazing. I got it in white. Uh, you know, it fits, it fits my basic controller. I mean, my basic gamepad uh, for the Wii U color scheme. I, I really do like it. It looks really, really good. Um, it feels slightly heavier than my PS3 controller, but a lot less heavier than my Xbox controller. So, you know, it's got its... its downsides and upsides it's really really big it's a lot larger than my ps3 controller and it just feels really neat but again uh, with the analog controls uh the analog sticks being above the d-pad i'm so used to having them be above the d-pad and you know it's just so weird having them both up there so i have to keep fumbling down and i keep pressing a instead of b when i try to reload and i keep hopping stupidly and i'm still trying to get the hang of drop shotting with the the Pro Controller, but I definitely do recommend it <laughs> until they fix the Wii Remote. I think this is what I'm going to be using just because of the fact that it's really, really simple and, you know, as long as you get the hang of it, just play a couple games and you will get the hang of the Pro Controller. It's really, really good. Uh, definitely recommend it. You guys should try it out. It's $50, so it's kind of steep price, but you know, it's the same price as other controllers. Um, I got it out of the box and I was able to play with it. I didn't have to charge it. It had about two bars of battery left when I actually plugged it in or synced it with my Nintendo uh, Wii U. So I definitely recommend it. It's really, really good controller. You know, it's better than the CCP in my opinion because, I mean, I do like the fact that the CCP has the analog sticks in the correct place for me. You know, just like the ps 3 controller, they have the uh, analog sticks down there. But, you know, it's not wireless and it's... For me, personally, the Wii, Wii Remote cord getting, it just really irritates me when it keeps touching my hand when I'm using the CCP, so I gotta definitely admit that the Wii U controller is really, really good. I, I, I like it, personally. And, you know, it, it takes a, a while to get used to it. I still, personally, haven't gotten very used to it. I keep fumbling with the controls still, but, and the sensitivity, too. But I definitely, definitely recommend it. It's really, really, it feels really comfortable as well, so, you know. 
So yeah, this is actually my first public, you know, well, not really first public game, but you know, my first kill confirmed game with a bunch of other people. Uh, that is in gun game where you actually have to try to win. There's an objective. That's uh, not really more of just shoot them up and you know collect tags. And I definitely recommend when you're using, uh, when you're playing kill confirmed, if you can find a kill confirmed game. By the way, if you can't find kill confirmed or other kind of games, check out my previous commentaries. My previous two commentaries that I've uploaded, I mentioned how to find games and you know get lobbies and everything set up so you can actually play in modes that you can't play right now because of the simple fact that there's not enough people playing it. So if you have questions about that, go ahead and check, uh, check out those commenters or just leave a comment below and I can help you out. But uh, yeah, definitely recommend using uh, in Kill Confirmed a shotgun because of the fact that you're going to be running and gunning with the shotgun. So it makes, you know, picking up tags a lot more convenient. You're just... I mean, you're, you just shot them up, so you might as you're just gonna you might as well just run what two feet to the guy's corpse and pick up his kill uh, dog tags. So it's definitely what I recommend when I, I when I first used the shotgun on PS3 and kill confirmed. I was running about 40, 50 uh, tags, a lot of tags, you know, individually just on myself because I'm just running and shooting people, and I mean their tog tags are right there. And about dying, I really don't care about kill streaks. Luckily, I didn't die way too much this game. But you know, the lag was really pretty bad this game. And uh, look at that collateral sweep. That was my first collateral. I'm like, yes, yes, I'm gonna go with Mr. Hunt noobs on this. And then I died right there. <laughs> mm, but yeah, it was a really, really good game. And I definitely feel it. Uh, Pro controller definitely feels comfortable and definitely feels natural when playing. And unfortunately, you know. I, it does take some getting used to, but yeah, definitely, if you want to get a kill confirmed game, it was just pretty fun, especially if you're a shotgunner, definitely, if, if you like using shotguns in general, this is the best mode for you, so yeah, this little thing fucking killed me when I'm trying to get my care package, so I'm going to go back and destroy it, and look at this, bam, miss, got it, got it, you're mine, yes you are. Anyways, uh, so yeah, I got my care package, and basically, like I, like I said, if you're gonna want to be rushing, if if you're a rusher, kill confirmed is the best game mode for you because of the fact that you can rush. I mean, you're already rushing, right? And for every little kill, com every confirmed kill that you receive, you get points for it. So it helps you get your kill streaks a lot faster as well. So if you get like if you kill a guy and then you confirm his tags, that's just a lot more points that you can get. So if you're a rusher, kill confirmed is definitely the best game mode for you. Using a shotgun on kill confirmed wouldn't hurt either because it just works really well with uh, the whole rusher scenario as well. Anyways, so yeah, that's basically what I have covered is uh, my thoughts on the pro controller, which is really, really good. Uh, my thoughts on kill confirmed and some tips. So I hope you guys have found this commentary helpful. You know, I'm trying to help anyone I can out. I actually went on today trying my controller out and I noticed there was about 970 people online. Uh, I, I'm like, whoa. So I went and checked which playlist had people. And basically, I only found people in gun games, search and destroy, and some people that I rarely ever find on Kill Confirmed. As like I stated before, this is my first Kill Confirmed gameplay. I'm not sure if this is the first Kill Confirmed gameplay on YouTube on the Wii U, but if it is, come on guys, we gotta really start playing other modes. I understand that you maybe only stick to TDM because it's the best way and fastest way to find a game that you know doesn't have a crappy connection like this game had. Uh, but you know, go out and join playlists that are empty or, or that have one person and wait it out invite people and you'll get a fun lobby like this luckily though i did bust my ass uh to try to win it but unfortunately again i we didn't we were in the lead and somehow uh while i called in my kill streak we somehow didn't have the lead anymore and we lost but unfortunately i kicked ass i mean unfortunately i lost but you know our team lost, but luckily I kicked ass and I got you decent kill confirmed gameplay, a really close one at that. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed and you know subscribe for more content.